Hello, welcome back to Of Dog's channel. It's me, Of Dog. Today, I just entered the Sensei Panda Ken Era Saga. Uh, I didn't want to get all these rewards without recording it, so I'm just making a little video. I'm going to skip all the cutscenes and just do the combat. The cutscenes are interesting if you want to. The cutscenes are interesting. Uh, if you want to see them, you can always go on Armor Gaming's channel. He's got a video of them all. I'm just going to auto it. Using gold runes on my moon mine. So that's just. That's just how it goes sometimes. These roulette wheels are something else. They're something special. That's how I had to record these. Hopefully they load quicker. Okay, so I had to stop it there because it was taking too long to load. Oh, whoops. First one I got 50 Elementium. Oh well, 500k gold. I'm just gonna... There's plenty of spins, so it's not always worth gambling. You can get a spin on every level, so... Still got level 3 runes on both Moon Ming and... Uh, that snake guy. Forget what it's called. Oh, another 50 Elementium. Nice. I would have preferred to loot him though. Or loot him, however you say it. Oh, aye, it's Noir. That's why I called it Noah's Ark. So. Just gonna put speed and team speed on this. Funny little rune set up there, but it was just off the top of my head. Called Panda Ken, the Sensei Panda Ken, Pandy King. Pandy Ken, but Panda King. And also like a big mad Sensei Panda Ken. The other dungeons have even better increasing rewards. That's 300, no, I mean 150, 150 Elementium in about 5 weeks. Got no time for these cutscenes. If you want to watch them, like I say, you can always find them on Armor Gaming's channel. I'm just going to do a uh, dungeon by dungeon. Oh, darn. Panda Ken, Sensei Panda Ken makes like 460 gold when you take him to level, well I've got him at level 100, he makes 65 gold or something, which is on par or even more than Mr. Beast, Mr. Beast being the, being the old highest earner, but uh, Dream only makes 365. Like gold per minute. This shouldn't take long. It's a. Uh... Well, I've not even set this set the skills on. I've not even set the skills on thing. Me, which call them Sensei Panda can you? I have to do that just now. Yes. Ten gems. Here we go. That makes up for the other gambles I did earlier, and unsuccessfully gambled. So, I 
I'll pause it while I do this. So these are the skills I picked. Eucalyptus, eucalyptus flavor, three inch punches, zen meditation and combustion. I might as well put on a sword relic. I'll pause it while I do this too. So that's me set the relics for all of these guys. You can see them there. Sherazar's amulet. Level 1 relics on uh, Moon Ming. I put decent ones on Sensei Panderkin so he can get the job done. Doesn't look like he's needing to do much, but he'll come in handy for a regeneration guy and a healer in the later uh, nodes. Oh, what a crapsman. Might as well risk it because I got 10 earlier. Oh, yeah, that's what I spent. Banging. Lutton's probably the best thing you can get from this right now. Between the weekends when you can't do the Titan and get hundreds that way. Skip that cutscene. On to a level 80 uh, corrupted monster there, Bowden up. Whoops, I made a click. Thing there. Possession and stun. Decent, and then the sword takes that guy up. Spun it the way that I usually spin the monster wood roulette spin wheel. Oh, that was crap. Thought it may have worked. I should, should have spun it a little bit slower, I think. I'll just collect that because it's saying I've not got an internet connection. Bogus. It's totally bogus, man. I'll kill you more than not. I don't need you to talk, talk to me. Tell me to tell him an anecdote. I've not got an anecdote for you, pal. That's an anecdote. I'll tell it to others. Don't know what I'm talking about. It's been really like a that's my new eleven. Oh, have I got got thing? Oh, try to say I didn't have internet connection earlier, so I guess I must have got some from somewhere. Oh yes. lives up to the name that it says at the top of the dungeon, it's quite easy. Silver relic chest, I'll take that. Throw it on the stack. I'm gonna pause it for a little second until I get a few nodes further down. Hey. 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 Just going back in now in the last battle. Three miles takes the first shot. Clean that. Daze them all. Possess and if I can, stun them. Elegant kick. Kick. Kick Fay Malice off a little high horse. And that's how it's done. Very easy. Only using level 3 runes. Accidentally pressed that, so I just went with it. And then auto for the last little second. And that takes us to the very end of the easy level 
of the Sensei Pandakin saga, era saga. I will be making another video, oh nice, nice 10. I'll be making another video for the hard one. Uh, I might as well play this cutscene and play play the video out. Corrupting root relic, heal from him, crushed by him. See you after. In fact, I'm not going to end the video there, I'm just going to go with it and show you what's going down in game. Uh, these are all epics that I've been trying to breed uh, for Vanos and also to breed epics in the race. Got a Djinn, which I can just sell whenever I, whenever I need to. And I'll quickly show you the race. It's getting to the last days of the, days of the race. Uh, so this is us winding down. I didn't get any PvP wins and I can't be bothered breeding 511. So that makes the end of the video. Cheers for if you stuck with me to the end. Uh, new videos coming all the time. Uh, as soon as I make some more progress, I'll get on it. Uh, drop a like. Drop a like if you like the content. Drop a sub if you want more. And see you there. Later. Bye.